Hello and welcome, everyone. This is Kaylin's English podcast. This podcast is designed for English learners. I'm here to help you practice your listening skills. I'm Kaylin, a professional English teacher on Italki. Today's episode, I'm going to run through some facts about the United States of America. I was born there, and while growing up, I was continually taught American history in school. I did not know if other countries cover American history, but America basically ensures that their children learn as much as possible. I'm going to share some facts that I find interesting that I have learned. Our first fact is that the United States consists of 50 states, a federal district, and 14 territories. Only five of the territories are inhabited by people. The 50 states are represented on the national flag as the stars, and the 13 stripes represent the original 13 colonies. I'm from the state of Ohio, which was not one of the original 13 colonies. The colonies were Virginia. Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Connecticut, New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Delaware, Maryland, North Carolina, South Carolina, and Georgia. There are national symbols of the USA. The American bison is the national animal. The tree is the oak tree. Bald eagle is the national bird, and the rose is the national flower. Most people know the bald eagle is the national bird. But the other national symbols do not always get as much recognition. The most populous state of the U.S. is California, and the least is Wyoming. The largest state by land area is Alaska. Alaska is roughly the size of Germany, Austria, Switzerland, Italy, and France combined. Every state has some unique characteristics about them, and you can find different types of weather conditions, ways of living, and landscapes. Many Americans do not have a passport, and some have never even left their home state. I personally do not blame people for not leaving the country, as you can find whatever you are interested in within the country, from snow sports to beaches to mountains to water sports. There is also a diverse wildlife population: buffalo, snakes, polar bears, black bears, grizzlies, birds, and coyotes. You can pretty much find any animal. There are three major rivers: Mississippi, Missouri, and Colorado. It is also home to what are called the Great Lakes, which are superior. Erie, Huron, Michigan, and Ontario. Where I'm from, Lake Erie is above us. English is the most commonly used language, but is not the official language of the country. It is an official language in all 50 states. There are more than 300 languages that are spoken. 78% of people only speak English, but 13% mainly speak Spanish. The continental U.S. spans over five time zones, and Hawaii has a different time zone as well. Many states follow daylight savings time, spring forward, and fall back. Most of Arizona and some other areas do not follow daylight savings times. The country is divided into six regions: New England, the Mid Atlantic, the South, the Midwest, the Southwest, and the West. New England consists of Connecticut, Maine, Massachusetts. New Hampshire, Rhode Island, and Vermont. The Mid Atlantic includes Delaware, Maryland, New Jersey, New York, Pennsylvania, and the District of Washington D.C. The South includes Alabama, Arkansas, Florida, Georgia, Kentucky, Louisiana, Mississippi, North Carolina, South Carolina, Tennessee, Virginia, and West Virginia. The Midwest has Illinois, Indiana, Iowa, Kansas, Michigan, Minnesota, Missouri, Nebraska. North Dakota, Ohio, South Dakota, and Wisconsin. The Southwest has Arizona, New Mexico, Oklahoma, and Texas. Finally, the West consists of Alaska, Colorado, California, Hawaii, Idaho, Montana, Nevada, Oregon, Utah, Washington, and Wyoming. I am from the Midwest, as I was born in Ohio. I think that is enough facts for one day. I hope you have learned something new about my home country. That is all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed. If you'd like more content, then please subscribe to this podcast. You can also support me on Patreon. Find me by typing in Kaylin Teacher. On Patreon, you can gain early access to the podcast and transcriptions. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Kaylin underscore Teacher. Thank you for listening. I hope you all have a great day. Until next time, bye.